Hey you guys, welcome to the test kitchen. Today, Nick and I yeah. are gonna be making some honey garlic chicken. This is something I make on the regular at home, but it's got some crap sauce that has a bunch of chemicals, preservatives. Right, get and rid so, of that. Yeah, we're gonna make this the correct way and Clean it's gonna way. taste even better. It's gonna be bomb. So you guys come right back for our honey garlic chicken. Okay, and then what we're gonna do, we're gonna use olive oil to get our garlic going. And then we're gonna, um, just a little bit, because we wanna limit the amount of fat in this dish. Then we'll use water from there okay. to finish cooking. So once the pan kind of dries out, or once we get our garlic toasted, we'll use water. It's a really good calorie-free cooking agent. How about that one? Dude, right. I'm learning as we go. <laughs> Rock and roll. And then over here, I'll help mix up the sauce. We got some rice already cooked. It'll come together great at the end. So go ahead with some olive oil okay. in the pan. Just a little dab now. You yeah. want to make a good swirl. If you don't swirl it, it doesn't cook right. We think we two got more there? swirls. Two you more. Want two swirls. more. Two yeah. more. I can even draw. I'll, I'll draw your name in here. I'm like a balloon artist, but with our olive oil. There you go. Okay. How about that garlic. That's what I'm talking Toss about. Toss it in. We can use your little. I can use it. You want me to use Fingers, the official whatever method? Whatever you want. Whatever oh, you yeah. want. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Mm. Wooden spoon. I used to get spanked with these a lot. You know, it's kind of weird to be using it for cooking. My mom, she would just smack them on the counter and break them, yelling at me. Uh, and then dad would come home with his belt. Ah. That was how it was done, right? <laughs> Fun memories of our childhood, right. really. And then here, we've got two pounds of organic, boneless, skinless chicken breast. It's going to give it a little salt and pepper. Um, Okay. And then, dude, yeah. what is not better with garlic? Garlic and olive oil, they say uh, that's, know, that's the realm of voluptuosity. You ever hear that one? Voluptuosity, go ahead and spell that, folks. <laughs> Don't Google it, spell it. And we'll see what we're looking for here is just a nice kind of toasted brown, oh, golden brown edges coming along. You see a little bit in that one. Yeah, sizzling, <laughs> smelling, burning my forehead. And Good. then we're gonna take this here, seasonings on the top, so we're gonna get the season side down into the garlic. Oh, this is where you want me to do our little maneuver. Yeah, let's okay. see it. Whoa! Oh. That's where it pays to have the, the man hands, huh? Yes. All right. Salt, salt and pepper on the top right okay. now. Oh, yeah. you bet, you bet. Okay, so we're just gonna wait a little bit. That looks pretty good. Ooh! And then what should we talk about? This is based off of what Frank's red hot yeah. honey garlic stinging stinging, stinging honey, honey garlic, garlic yeah. sauce. So if you guys haven't had it, it's it's really good. It's uh, I think you can get it at most major stores, but it's this Frank red hot uh, stinging honey garlic sauce. And it's something that I use a lot. It's a, got a little bit of heat, but I am absolutely not tolerant of spicy food. So if I can eat it, you can eat it. I promise. Cool. And it is so good. Okay. Like so we're going to recreate it just better. We took a look at the ingredient list. It has sugar, molasses, honey, and corn syrup. Yeah. All four of those in there. And some other stuff. So we're just going to stick with honey. But we'll start with uh, apple cider vinegar. Okay. Boom. Like that. And then this is a good local honey. Hidden Valley honey. Yeah. Have you heard of those I guys? No, I have not. It's like a jar full oh, of nature. God. Okay, how about that much? Oh. Man. And we'll use our whisk. Kind of hard because the vinegar is cold, but yeah, we'll get her going. God, this smells good. Good stuff. Yep. The garlic just does it. It really does. You feel like you need water in there yet or not? You know, I'm Looking getting good. close. Looking good. Still, yeah, good. still moist. We got one there. Okay, you got that mixed up. And then garlic, we're going to use a little granulated garlic in here too. You can't tell there's gonna be some garlic in this meal. I just think honey garlic has a great, good ring to it, doesn't it? It really does. It really does. Let's try that so okay, far. What are we looking at? Wow. Not too bad, right? It's kind of like a vinaigrette dressing. Yeah, I didn't expect the. Oil. the uh, I didn't expect the apple cider vinegar to taste that good with it. That's really good. Little cayenne, like you said, we don't want to make. Woo! That, that we last little. It, <laughs> That'll make you sweat, turn your ears Over red. The top. Oh yeah. Make you squirm in your seat a little bit. Try that one. Okay, hang on. Got some chicken burning here. Need some chicken tendon. All right, all right. What are you thinking, guy? I like it. I like it so far. <laughs> no, come on. I stuck come it on. in. I stuck it in. It's not hot. <laughs> okay. A little bit of salt, bring it to life. Dude, Watch I think that wasn't hot at all. Let's give her. That salt is all. Now I'll try it. Finger licking chicken. 
pretty bomb right there. That's, you want some more honey do, in there? You want more honey? What go, do you want? I think we go a tiny bit more honey, just like a very okay. small amount to thicken it up a little bit. And then maybe uh, I do another pinch of garlic because you can't ever overdo that. I think I just scratched that mic. Sorry if that got your ears. Oh, we'll go right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Chicken's coming along oh, nicely. Yeah, we don't even need water, right? We don't no, even need water. It stayed really, really nice. Okay, we, we want a little bit. Let's try it now. Okay, yes, I think we go some garlic in that. And we've hit you want the a little money. more heat? You want a little more heat Dude, or not? Dude, put some cayenne in that old boy. You know what I'm talking about? But eh, like Irish person there we go. cayenne. There we go. Right there. It's funny how you can tolerate different like spices. I can do um, like Asian spices really well, like wasabi and that type of stuff. Uh, but the the more like Mexican spices, like yeah. if I do like a serrano pepper, funny story. Get out of town. You ready for you ready for uh, story time? Yeah. Okay. Is this in Ireland in a bath? Nope, this oh. is in elementary school. Elementary, no, middle school. Sorry, middle school. Middle school. I had yeah. this uh, teacher, Senor Martillo, means Mr. Hammer. Anyways, oh. we did, <laughs> if you didn't know, no big deal. So we uh, had this pepper eating contest. Yeah. And so you'd go up and you and another person would go up to the table. I think we're looking pretty solid here, guy. What do you think? Let's just let it roll and then we'll put this in there okay. and, and kind of get it to coat. How much right. do you want? Uh, that, that probably is about right. So you go up to this counter and it's got all these peppers, yeah. okay? And then so the whole thing is you're supposed to eat this pepper, you want to go against another person, and you have to do these ridiculous stunts that he asks you to do. And if you break face, whether it's like you're making, like, oh, it's so hot, or if you start laughing or yeah. anything, if you just go, you have Stone Cold Steve Austin, Steve Austin just blue steel them. And if you do, if you break, then you lose. Okay, so I go up. And back then, like, I couldn't even eat hot Cheetos. Like, no spice whatsoever. Black yeah. pepper would burn my ass. So yeah. I just went up there. Naturally, you roll the dice. The higher the dice number is, the more spicy your pepper is. Okay. So, naturally, I roll a six, right? I don't know what the, the gal I was doing it with uh, the, was going, I guess she rolled some, whatever. I eat this serrano pepper. And it's like, he just gives you like a, a raw serrano pepper. Yeah. And I just bite it down to the stem. And it jacked me up so bad. I was in the back of the room puking. I drank, was <laughs> drinking milk. I was drinking, eating ice cream. I was out of school. This isn't even, I swear to God, it's true. I was out of school sick for three days. I'm serious, I'm dead serious. <laughs> like it ruined my life. Never heard that So one. yeah, now I try to eat some more spicy food more often to kind of build my tolerance. And I'm getting up. You know, I could eat taptio, yeah. sriracha. Yeah. It's so good. you're more of a wasabi guy. I like wasabi. Wasabi yeah. mayo. You ever done wasabi mayo? Yeah, yeah wasabi mayo is some bomb. Sriracha mayo. But too. not as good as this honey garlic we're making. Nothing like this. I tell you what. Here it comes, baby. All right. So we're starting to get that. What do you think? You like in. it? I'm starting to Should like try it. Try a piece of chicken. You better believe it. Yeah. Is that mm. warm there, guy? Mm. Hey. What do you think? A little more salt? Try that. Do you want the rest of this sauce in there? Or are you good? You're good. I think we're good. I mean, we have yeah. quite a bit of sauce that's still standing. I so think we go. Cut the heat and then that'll coat it. I think as it cools, it'll coat yeah. that chicken. Okay. And we'll garnish with these killer uh, scallops. Can I get a, just a little knickknack patty whack and some garlic? Oh. Thank you, sir. See, look at this guy calling audibles over here, huh? Yep. That's just a little bit. All right, so we're gonna portion oh, this out yeah. into four portions. We'll go three that we'll send to the lab to get the accurate macros, right? The yep. nutrition facts. And then one for pretty pictures and for us to eat. That's what Sound I'm good? talking about. Heck yeah. All right, you guys, we're gonna do that and then we'll be back. Stay tuned. Yeehaw. All right, Sean, we did it, man. Nice we work. We did it, Woo. yes, sir. All portioned out here. We've got three here. We're gonna send to the lab to get some super accurate nutrition facts. We plated this one up, and we're just gonna give it a little bit of a garnish right now. Yep. How about sauce? If they don't, if they want more sauce, yeah. what should they this do? This is our that? this is our honey garlic sauce that we just made. Um, it's really good. If and so we're gonna have it's the chicken is cooked in it, and then we're gonna be drizzling extra sauce on top of that. But if you're one of the people who's an extra saucy pants and you want some extra kick in it, you can get that Frank's Red Hot uh, Stingin' Honey Garlic Chicken and put that over the top as well. You don't need it, but if you like it extra saucy, I definitely recommend so that option. It. But here, this is ready to roll. I and mean, what about, tasty. I mean, should we make uh, Sean's 
stinging garlic chicken with the, that. The Sweeney stinging garlic. Sean's, the, Sean's red hot. The, <laughs> yeah, co coming out hot sauce. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one, yeah. Oh. That should be a Travis Williams sauce. Coming out hot coming sauce. Coming out hot. Yeah, yeah. Or maybe a little. Oh, dude, that How's was. That? that was. It's the money shot. Though. That is good. Nicely done, Nick. Yeah, Nicely done. Yeah, man. I'm excited. Let's go uh, eat this. Nice low fat option. Yeah. That's what we were going for here. Um, high well. carbs, so it can keep you fueled yeah. for the day. This is I, when I eat this is like in intra training. So before anything that's going to be close to my training window is when I typically do this uh, a meal like this, where it's really lean. It's got a lot of carbs okay. and the fats are very minimal. Uh, plus, this is just something like after you get done with a really hard workout, you don't want like something that's overly saucy and just crazy, right. you know, rich. Yeah. So this is something that after you're kind done training, I meal. really basic. like this. Yeah, absolutely. Basic. Chicken feels, or rice. You know, it, it is clean, but it just feels feels good to eat this after training. Eating something that's too saucy sometimes a little much. Cool. Yep. Well, thanks again, yeah, man. Absolutely. You guys watch for this on the menu coming out. This is uh, our honey garlic chicken. Honey garlic chicken. And until next time, we're here helping you eat better and live longer. Eat better. Live longer.